In a perfect world, our scientists and innovative companies would be able to prevent diseases or through early detection, treat them before they become life-threatening or impact our quality of life. As anyone who has struggled with a disease or has lost loved ones know, the world is not perfect. Today, we rely on our life science innovators to develop new products and services that our healthcare teams can use to help us fight and help us heal. BD Peripheral Intervention is one of those innovators and is being honored as the 2020 Arizona Bioscience Company of the Year. Join me for a conversation with Stephanie Clocky, Vice President of Research and Development at BD Peripheral Intervention to learn what it takes to make a global impact. We have launched over 12 projects in the last um, year and a half and we're really excited about the impact that they have on our patients. You know, one specific product I'll describe is our BD Elevation Breast Biopsy System. When I think about the patients who are impacted by this device, these are women who have recently identified that they have a lump in their breast and they are at risk of cancer. They have a significant amount of stress and anxiety and anything that we can do with our devices to help improve and minimize that stress is a big win for us. The BD breast elevation device does that. This is a handheld vacuum excision biopsy device that the physician can insert with one time and get all samples needed for the biopsy in less than 10 seconds. So any procedure that can be done in less than a minute, let alone 10 seconds, is a significant win for the patient. BD Peripheral Intervention moved into a new headquarters on the Tempe IDEA campus in March. It was really exciting and a long-awaited process to get us there. The team worked very hard to get moved in. The building is incredible. We have a fantastic state-of-the-art research and development lab that really helps us innovate and the location is just fantastic. We are located on the IDEA campus, which stands for Innovation, Discovery, Education and Arts which is perfect for us as we really are founded on innovation. When I think about our team, not only do they work all day long endlessly on bringing life-saving products to market, they also constantly give back to our community. They're involved in community walks and fundraisers. You know, we even had a team of about five to six people who walked from Tucson to Phoenix over a five-day period to specifically raise funds for a local veterans organization called the Fisher House. So. We truly have an incredible organization of employees and they never cease to amaze. As COVID-19 has spread across the world, BD has been a key partner in the national and the global response. So BD has really made a positive impact on the current fight against COVID. And in one way, we as BD have provided more than 40 million swabs that are used for specimen collection associated with COVID-19. BD also has two diagnostic tests on the market. One is the BD Max system, the system is a molecular diagnostic PCR test that's used to diagnose COVID. Test results are obtained in about four to six hours. Uh, however, it can take longer to get back to patients due to administrative needs and as many patients are experiencing today. Uh, and then in early July, BD launched the Veritor point of care antigen test and the benefits here is speed to diagnosis. How this works is they take a anterior nasal swab and ultimately get the results within 15 minutes to the patient. It's really incredible work that the team is doing to help um, with the fight against COVID. BD's purpose is to advance the world of health. And you know, as we've talked about, we launched more than 12 new products over the last year, but the future is extremely bright. And this year in 2020, we're launching 10 new programs. We have 20 active medical device products under development currently, and that never stops. As soon as one's finished, we're working on the next thing. Our goals are to improve healthcare, specifically in the realms of oncology, end-stage kidney disease, and peripheral arterial disease. That's our mission, and that's what we plan to do for the future.